it actually makes me feel physically sick in here. Hello and welcome back to the channel. I'm Alex and behind the camera is Jack, my best fret colleague. Today's episode, we're going to be looking at Omega Spec. You may remember, I bought this car at auction for a really good price. No, no, no. You may remember, I bought this car at market value. In no. You may remember, I completely f***ed myself by paying twice the amount for this car than I really should have done. Paint is missing, punch in the side, so whoever owned this car, probably did a hit and run. We've got three sun wide tires and one high fly tire. Michelin's nah, forget it. Pirelli's nah, sort that. We do have rust on the arches here, but that's standard. And then the rear end, it's just like the designers were like, oh yeah, we've done a good job on the front. The rear can't be asked. It looks like a hearse. It's just so unidentifiable. The same, however, cannot be said about the interior. Can we just not do the interior? I'd just prefer just to leave it. You've had your jabs, you'll be all right. All right. <gasps> Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to hell. This is easily the most disgusting interior I have ever seen. This bodily fluid, 100%. Jack, you reckon it's it, semen? It's definitely a nut, yeah. <sighs> I mean, even like the centre console is, there's so much grime, there's, there's finger juice everywhere. Oh, Christ. Hold on, one sec. Let me just rub it a little bit. Oh, my word. Oh, Christ, I'm sitting on the nut. Look at that. Look at how rough that, oh. Oh, my God. That's, that's horrendous. And that's horrendous. <coughs> DNA. Oh, is that like a sneeze? <coughs> Look at this! Can you see that? Oh, like... no. It actually makes me feel physically sick in here. There's just so much wrong with it. Do you have a look in the back? Yeah, the, the, the front's probably the best bit. Oh, God. Oh, touched it. Everywhere you look, there's just movement, because there's just stuff hanging and... Jack, do you want to swap? Not really, Do you no. want to do... I can do the camera. No. Honestly, I've no. watched you for years do it. It's easy. Oh, my God, look how clean that is. I can actually touch that. Wow! Do you come back to the front again, Jack? I'll just show you down there in the crack what colour this seat should actually be. What do you reckon to that? Oh, wow. Is that a different colour? Totally. <laughs> Completely different shade. I think that bit's a different seat. <laughs> I'm, I'm getting it. I'm getting it in my lungs. Oh, no. You're just literally breathing in someone's DNA. There's quite a few viruses going around at the moment. I think I'm going to start my own strain. Kirsten virus. There's a tissue. You gotta get it out then. I'm not touching. Oh, what is that? Get it out. I'm not, I am not touching that. Get it, I dare you. Oh, what is it? I don't know. Right, let's have a look in the booty, which is again, just disgusting. It must have been used as a parts car or a murder car. I mean, this is not salvageable. Like up here, all the carpets pretty much ruined with oil and dog hair and probably feces. I mean, fair play to the car, the boot is massive. Useful as a car van, but disgusting as a car. And it is 100% the grimiest, most disgusting car I've ever been in. I bet you've been in some real Romans as well. Oh, I have. Yeah, you should have seen some of my ex girl But it's not all bad news, okay? So the interior has probably given me herpes. However, this car is rear wheel drive. And the good thing with old, cheap crap cars like this is I don't care where I park it. I don't need to pay top quality fuel for it. And if it does break, then I can probably get around 250 pounds scrappage on this car. You'll get what you should have paid. Yes. One more. Enough talking. Let's go for a drive. Don't even want to put the equipment down in it. Don't, don't touch the nut. I feel like it's a good car underneath all the dust. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. But one thing it does have going for it is 77,652 miles. That's an average of, I think, 4,400 miles a year. Everything feels all right. Just the interior is just so drab and boring. There's a big S button on top of the uh, disgustingly shaped gear knob. I'm going to push that, and then I reckon this is going to transform. Power is going to increase. It's going to hunker down a lot more. Yeah. Maybe, maybe or let's just S and it's just been in skip mode, and that's why it's so filthy in here. Potentially. Three, two, one. I 
I think Esther's broken. Yeah. There is one thing that we definitely have to do. We've got to detail it, don't oh, we? Oh, yeah. Anyway, let's head over to Limitless Detailing. Right, here we are at Limitless Detailing. First impressions, please. Absolutely amazing car. We're gonna try our best, make it look great for you. And I also wanna point out that this isn't your usual clientele, is it? No. I mean, there's a Lambo there, there's a Jag, there's a Brabus. Anyway, I think there's only one thing left for me to do in typical Wheeler dealer style. Hand you over the key. Thank you, you very much. There you go, mate. <laughs> I've just given you my shitbox. Good luck. All right. Right, a mega spec. Mark II. Let's have a look. I'm gonna do that. Holy f It's blue. Oh my goodness, look at the side of it. Wow. You've taken years off it. And it's metallic, who knew? That is such a huge difference. That's beautiful. We could sell that for 501 pounds. Interior, this was the... Uh, Biggest sticking point, and I don't say sticking point lightly. It was rough as f I mean, there's no way around it. Oh my God. Oh, it smells amazing. The wood is wood colored and shiny. Where's the semen stains? Did you get rid of the semen? And we have carpet and we have no grime. Do you remember what this looked like inside? This is incredible. I can literally And do you remember the mirror? It doesn't taste of disease. Do it once more. Oh, sorry, sorry, once more. Shut your face! <laughs> I cannot believe how clean this is and how good it smells. And we still have the auction sticker as well. That's amazing. Right, let's move back because the further back you got, the more disgusting it was. The boot. Remember last time in the auction place when I went in there and I came out and my knees were covered in, I don't know, like melted animal. Oh my goodness. Is that the same carpet? Because this was all oil, wasn't it? I, I would lick it. It just tastes of detergent. Oh my God. You see, now I don't mind being in here. I'm ready to come out now though. You've like done crazy stuff here. Come on, Julian. How are you? How many hours do you reckon you've spent on this? Uh, about 30 hours, I'd say. So more than a full day? Yeah, it was. Is that why you look really tired? <laughs> <laughs> it was hard work, but we got there in the end. How did you get rid of the grime? Because I thought that was a complete write-off. Well, we used a wet vac, to be honest. Yeah. And it was just big, thick, mud was it and nice? oil and grime underneath yeah. when you collected fun. all the dirty water did you do shots yes <laughs> <laughs> of course we did and the seats are actually i know they literally nice changed color, color. <laughs> oh wow jesus and there used to be a mouse living in here yeah i mean that was just full of a mouse's home but yeah <laughs> i'm stunned fair play man this is incredible massive shout out to uh, the guys at limitless detailing if you have a Vauxhall Amiga estate <laughs> and you want to get it cleaned, then come here. No, but seriously, the job that you guys have done on the paintwork, on the interior, is, is just far beyond what I expected could be done with this car. Thank you. Make sure you guys follow Limitless Detailing. There'll be a link there somewhere because they're good guys and they definitely know what they're doing. I'm impressed. Are you impressed? I'm very impressed. Jack, are you impressed? Uh, it's insane. It's, yeah. It's safe. Here. It's not legal, really. I just want to prove how clean this is. Jack, if you just open the passenger side door. I want you to kiss, <laughs> kiss the jism. It was just here. It was yeah, it was, yeah, go on, give it, give it a little. There was a big old nut. Go on, <laughs> go on, pucker up. Go on, don't be shy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
And on that sexy note, I think, uh, I think it's time to end the episode. Make sure you subscribe to the channel over here because this car isn't going to look like this for much longer, is it, Jack? No, it isn't. I've got some power tools and we're going to do some, something excellent. Um, shall we reveal what we're doing? Go Alright, we're turning this into a pickup truck. So, uh, yeah, it's going to be awesome and also make sure you check out the rest of the videos down here. We'll see you next time.